Hello, my name is Chris Maynard from CMIVFX.com and this is the Flame Procedural Shading Techniques Training Video. This video also applies to Smoke and Smoke OS X with minor limitations on the OS X version, but the principles will all be the same. As they add more features to the OS X version, there will be a seamless interoperability between all three platforms. Currently, Smoke is using the phrasing Connect Effects in place of Flame's Batch Module, but primarily they are identical in the workflows and the layouts once you get inside. Before I get too far into technical instruction, I wanted to talk a little bit about what I've been doing for the last few months and or since the last time I recorded a video. I've been co-developing third-party applications for new feature inventions and upgrades so all you guys in the industry get some new toys to play with each year during NAB, IBC, and SIGGRAPH. I spend most of my days working with software vendors, creating and testing new tools and technologies in production environments to help mold alpha phase applications in the beta application testing phase. I do my share of beta testing as well, but mainly out of mere coincidence and timing. So I suppose you wonder why I'm making this video. Well, the truth of the matter is, the industry is heading for a major change. What used to be is now a foregone conclusion. What we're used to in a production pipeline is changing indefinitely due to vast changes in technology. I cannot disclose hardly any of the things that I know at this time regarding this matter, but I can certainly help guide you all in the right direction. Which leads me back to why I'm making this video. There is a war going on between CPU and GPU based rendering techniques. Software vendors are splitting down the seam in two different directions to try to become the standard in our not so distant future. New applications to replace our current look development pipelines are popping up all over the place. But the true integration of these apps causes some dysfunction along the way. I'm here to show you one possible scenario for the upcoming change in pipeline workflows. We are calling this new workflow CG Finishing. This is not to be confused with the standard VFX finishing term, nor is it to be confused with the Digital Intermediate franchise. This is a replacement for all CG workflow endings, where data is no longer rendered in your CG app, but is now rendered on the GPU in your VFX app. This used to be too expensive for the smaller studios to afford, but now it's too cheap not to afford. The price of smoke on OS X is so affordable and capable of handling complex scenes that artists can literally handle the whole second half of the production pipeline in one app. That's the dream of some other apps out there as well. Without disclosing information I'm legally bound by, I can say that Flame and Smoke are not the only systems that will be labeled as CG finishing systems in the next year. However, since Autodesk has done an incredible job integrating all of their substance texturing subsystems into their 3D compositing solution, they are currently on top of this new phase of industry standard. Other compositors can do similar construction and lighting of scenes, but none of them can create procedural texturing solutions nearly as fast and detailed and custom as the Substance Material Library from Autodesk. So if you are wondering who this video is for, it would be best to answer that question by saying you. You are the person that should be watching this video, because no matter if you are a compositor, animator, 3D modeler, or map painter, this technology affects you. And many of you could utilize this in your workflow, saving hours of test renders in your CG and compositing apps. If you're watching this video prior to buying, I hope you consider Smoke and Flame as within your reach and affordability and capability. There is no doubt about it. The industry is changing with or without you. Only you can decide where you want to be when it happens. So jump on over to CMIVFX today and invest in your future.